People in several communities are mourning the loss of a former Miss North Dakota. Samantha Edwards was found non-responsive by a friend inside a home in North Minneapolis. Thank you for joining us tonight. There are unanswered questions in the death of this 36-year-old. Investigators say there are no obvious signs of trauma to the body, but they're not saying if it's a natural death. An autopsy is being done. Investigators are waiting on those results before pursuing if it's suspicious or a crime. Valley News Team's crime and safety reporter, Nicole Johnson, spoke with Edwards' friends and has more. Dynamic personality, a big personality. Getting crowned is a special moment. Samantha Edwards had hers back in 2003. It is a death to the, the pageant community when a title holder dies, especially a state, state title holder. A role model is how Stacy Lentz describes Edwards. Lentz was the director of Miss North Dakota when Edwards was passing on her crown. She was very smart and she was beautiful. She was beautiful, absolutely beautiful with the dark hair and dark eyes. Edwards' death came as a shock to Lentz and a lot of others in the community, saying she was a beautiful person on the outside, but mostly in her heart. She would go out of her way to help anyone. I spoke with Edward's mom over the phone. She gave us these pictures. And when I asked how we could help, she said, bring my daughter back. According to Lentz, Edwards followed her dreams. She went to UND and Grand Forks, later moved to Minneapolis. She really did work to get what she wanted. So even though her life was really short, she really, you know, impacted a lot of people. Nicole Johnson, Valley News Live. There's a GoFundMe page set up for Edwards' funeral expenses. It has already surpassed the $15,000 goal. If you want to donate, we have a link to it on our website. Log on to valleynewslive.com and click on this story.